protein and Parkinson's disease. Recent studies have shown that eating a diet that is high in protein is an excellent part of treatment for patients with Parkinson's disease. Amanatha Cantosini, professor of biomedical sciences at the ISU College of Veterinary Medicine, has been working on this theory regarding the disease, and believes that protein can be a part of the cure. The research that Cantosini has done shows that there is a definite lack of dopamine, a chemical in the brain, in Parkinson's patients. This research also shows that there is a certain protein, protein kinase C, that kills the brain cells that produce dopamine. It is recommended that patients be on a low-protein diet. They still need protein in order to survive, but they must make sure that they are following a doctor-recommended diet and eating the right proteins. Getting the protein you need from your diet There are a number of ways that Parkinson's patients can get the protein that they need in their diets without getting too much. There are many delicious dietary sources, as well as a number of protein supplements, including liquid and powdered supplements. Protein in meat, poultry and fish, lean red meat, white meat poultry and fish are all excellent sources of protein, as well as a number of other vitamins and nutrients that are essential when it comes to renal care. In fact, these foods are some of the richest sources of protein that you can find. Turkey contains 28 grams of protein per 100 gram serving, and lean beef contains 25 grams of protein. A delicious cod fillet is 22 grams of protein per 100 gram serving, and good old tuna in oil contains 26 grams of protein. Proteins from nuts and seeds, this is another terrific way for vegetarians with renal troubles to get the protein that they need in their diets. Nuts are filled with protein, and as long as you are not allergic to nuts, they should be incorporated into your renal care diet. Some tasty, protein-rich nuts are cashews, peanuts, pumpkin seeds, almonds and sunflower seeds. Also, hemp seed is a great source of protein and is also full of antioxidants, vitamins and other nutrients. Proteins from grains, there are many delicious meals that you can make from grains that are high in protein, and these meals can be vegetarian or with meat included. One of the more popular grains that is quite protein rich is brown rice, which goes great with many different meats and other foods. Barley is also a high protein grain that should be a part of your renal care diet, and when added to homemade chicken soup, the amount of protein that you get is often as much as doubled. Protein supplements, Parkinson's patients who are not getting enough protein from dietary sources can use any number of the terrific protein supplements that are available. There are liquid supplements that can act as meal replacements and powdered supplements that can be incorporated into shakes and other recipes. One popular protein supplement is Profect, by Prodica. This supplement provides 25 grams of protein and has only 100 calories per 2.9 fluid ounce serving. Parkinson's and protein, a case study, Sam was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease several years ago. So far, his medications have kept his symptoms fairly at bay, but he is concerned. He is very interested in watching any and all developments regarding the research for this disease. He also enjoys reading about Michael J. Fox as he deals with the disease himself. Sam works with his doctor and nutritionist for a meal plan that keeps him as healthy as possible and also keeps his medications working properly. For instance, he has learned to time his largest protein meals for after his medications are taken so that they do not interfere with one another. In addition to good nutrition that is properly timed, Sam is being encouraged to get exercise and try to stay as active as possible. He has also joined a support group so that he can stay positive and focused. Another thing that he will be doing is adding Profect, a protein supplement from Protica, into his diet, both as a between-meal snack and occasionally just before a meal. It is easy to consume and comes in a variety of flavors so that he can switch them around as he needs. The benefit of Protica is the ability to mix it with other foods or beverages if one would like to. Sam will monitor his health and watch for signs that his symptoms are returning or progressing. He will go to the doctor at regular intervals so that he can keep his strength and his health at the level that it is at this point. He discusses tips and health hints with his support group and waits hopefully for a cure or a better treatment plan.